what is going on? It is Obadiah, and today we are back playing some Dark and Light. And today, I think we're going to start upgrading our life with some iron and metal gear. Um, if you guys do enjoy these videos, or if you learned something, do me a favor and hit that thumbs up button. And of course, feel free to subscribe and share and ring that notification bell if you haven't done so already. So, I have just spent a bunch of time gathering up all sorts of materials. We've got iron in here crafting. Let's go ahead and grab some of that. I don't even think that's going to be enough. Uh, but it's a good start. And we got some iron, we got some copper. I think we're also going to need some... Let's go ahead and throw this in here just preemptively so we don't have to carry it all. Uh, I think we need wood. We need twine. Let's see what else we need. Let's grab a couple stacks of wood. Let's grab a stack of twine. And a stack of fur, just in case. And maybe some of the magic shards, because I seem, seem to just need those at random times. And a little bit of hide. Um, and let's go ahead and throw this in here and kind of see what we can make. I have leveled up my melee crafting skill. So I should be able to make uh, metal tools now. Melee. Yes. What do we need for this one that we're missing? Copper ore. Oh, you need not smelted copper. Well, I got tons of that. That's no problem. Okay. So first, let's do this. Just like so. Let's go weapon. Uh, oh, I guess we'll make the crossbow first because there's one right here. That takes wood, twine, and iron ingots, which we have plenty. And then we'll do melee crafting. We'll make one of these scythes. An iron pickaxe. An iron axe. And what else is in here? A dagger? I don't know if we really need a dagger. It seems kind of, meh, not that important. Um, it does 35 damage, it said. How is that compared to these things? Yeah, these do more. What's really the point? Okay. Uh, and then I would like to make some armor as well. Uh, what do we need for that? What are we missing? Quartz sand. Oh, I do have a bunch of that I already preemptively made. Uh, there are some in here. And also, I think I have some more that I made in the mortar and pestle. Let's go ahead and grab that stuff. Yeah, we got tons of it. No problem. Let's go ahead and throw this stuff in here. Oh, weird. My taming bar is going up, which is strange. Um, and let's go ahead and do armor. Armor. Okay. So, right now, we're still wearing the cloth pants. So maybe we'll start with that. I think 70 ingots, though. That's so much. Um, and plus, the breastplate is going to be the coolest one. All right, let's go ahead and make the breastplate first. And then we'll maybe we'll make... I'm going to just take 50. And I'm going to add this one. 30. And this one's 30. So that's another 110. Oh, we don't even have that. So we can make maybe the head and the boots. We'll start with that. And we have to wait for let some more stuff craft up. Let's go ahead and see how this stuff's going to look, though. I'm um, going to grab all these things we just made. So we can finally get rid of this. Oh, I also learned another staff. Let's see if I can do it this way. Uh, staff. The Druidic Staff, which I knew we had one at some point, but we lost it somewhere. What does it take to make that? Wood, iron, or copper, unsmelted copper, and then some magic stuff. Let's go ahead and make one of those two. This, this. And what was the other one? Shoot, I forgot. Wood, maybe? Let's grab some wood. I'll grab this. All right, so staff. There it is. Perfect. Druidic staff. Go ahead and make that sucker. And finally, we can get rid of this stuff. Um, yeah, there's no real reason to carry around this sword except for... I guess it does harvest those flowers really well. Okay, so let's take everything off our hotbar here. And start equipping this stuff. So first, we're going to do the pick, then the axe, then the scythe. I guess we'll keep the iron sword for now. And then the crossbow. Oh, let's move that down a bit. For the staff. Perfect. We'll equip the helmet. See how that looks. And the boots. And then the regular armor. Woo! Well, that's a pretty cool looking armor. Um, I don't know what to do with all this stuff here. Let's just hold on to it for now. So we need to get some more copper, I do believe. And is there much more in here that we missed? Oh, you know what? We might already have some actually crafted. Let's see. Oh, we do! All right, let's keep this... Let's keep the crafting train rolling. All right, let's go ahead and throw this in here. Armor. Armor. All right, let's go ahead and just jump straight to the pants. Because we're still using the garbage cloth pants, and we can use a little bit more. How much armor do these have? 60 on those? Okay, throw those. Perfect. Uh, so what are we missing? We got copper helm. Copper breastplate. Copper greaves. Copper boots. Leather gauntlets. Let's go ahead and make those suckers up. Wow, we got blocked to the whole set done. I didn't even know if we'd be able to do that. Perfect. And we'll throw those on here. Now, they have, do these things have any magic resistance? No, just armor. Which is fine, because we haven't really found a use for magic resistance yet. 
Um, and then I do want to... Can I move all this stuff? Oh, sure can. So I'm gonna put this stuff away. Um, dude, we look cool now. Hey, where'd our light fairy go? Can we craft one of those up? There we go. Um, we actually have some decent armor now. I don't know how much that really helps us against creatures and whatnot. Let's light the way. But, uh, overall pretty cool. I bet we can paint this and stuff to be cool colors later on. Not worried about that right now. So, I'm gonna put that stuff away. And now I want to make a bunch of arrows. And let me show you why. I'm gonna try something a little risky. Out here, right outside of our base, there's a panther. You see him? See the panther guy up here? Hey, panther buddy. Let's just say what's up. And you're like, oh no, he's gonna kill you. But you know what? He's not. Because he's stuck. He's been stuck there for a couple days. So I think what I want to do is shoot him with arrows and try to knock him out. However, I'm like 99% sure they have to move and break the tethers to uh, be knocked out. So I'm going to shoot him a bunch of times, get those tethers rolling, and then uh, harvest that rock and have him chase us. And hopefully that'll knock him out. So I need to go gather a bunch of meat. I need to go make a bunch of arrows and get all that stuff ready. I was going to make the iron arrows, but you need this kind of like red mushroom that I don't have. Um, also... I've read that they don't do that much better. Ooh, there's a little drop over there. Let's go check that out. Um, usually it's just rocks and stuff, nothing that great, but we'll check it out. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and get some stuff ready to do a little bit of uh, murdering, kill some guys, get some meat, make a bunch of arrows. We're gonna see if we can get ourselves a freaking panther, because that would be awesome. All right, what's in this drop? Search. Oh, look at that, it's rocks. That's so exciting. All right, guys, we have got meat. We have got arrows on our crossbow. Let's go ahead and try this thing out. I don't know how tough this is gonna be. I don't honestly even know if this is gonna work. We're gonna put like 10 of these things in though and see how that goes and then harvest that rock. Oh, it didn't even take it. Okay, there's one. Two. Let's keep backing up because I think the longer it is, the better. Three. He's here. Okay, that should be good. Let's harvest this rock and then get the heck out of here. We're either gonna die very fast or we're gonna get ourselves an awesome guy. Okay, come on. Oh, is he still gonna be stuck? Hey, bud. He's not asleep, is he? Hey. Let's punch him. Oh man, after all that, he's still gonna be glitched out. I thought for sure we'd be able to get him over here. Come on. Oh, uh, what a bummer. All right, well, we're gonna have to go find something else to tame instead, because apparently this, one's, this one is not happening. And him just rotating, I don't think is enough. Will he actually attack us if we get close enough? Oh yeah, yeah, oh yeah, he will, certainly will. Uh, I guess we'll just kill him instead then. Get the experience. He's been sitting here for a while. All right, guys. So I was out. And I see there's like, a... Is that a boar over there? I don't know. It might be one of those big guys. But I do want to tame some more stuff. Oh, what's that? Oh, it's one of those guys too. Um, because we need to just tame some more stuff. Plus, I need to tame stuff to be able to level up to get some, uh... To be able to make the saddle for my freaking hyena. So I'm going to go ahead and put away what I just gathered up and then uh, maybe go see what else we can tame. Um, I also, I realized we can now make the magic bench. Where was that? Melee crafting? Magic craft? Is there a magic crafting? I don't remember where it was. Somewhere said we can now make the magic bench, which is super exciting. So I'm going to go ahead and see if I can go ahead and make that up. And then uh, try to go tame some stuff. All right, guys, there's a grut stag here that I do think we are going to tame up. Let's get a little bit of light here. Starting to get dark, it looks like. Um, now, these guys do run, which is super frustrating, but hopefully we can get them down pretty easily. Let's just do that. And let it reload. I'm hoping he gets doesn't get stuck somewhere too, too bad, like right there. That might not be the best. Come on. Get out of here, bud. Because they have to move. They have to move. There you go. Yeah, move, move, move. You gotta break, because you gotta break the little things for the torpor to take effect. I missed. Come on. Lead the target. Oh! Did he try to attack me? Whoa, I'm getting a little bit of framiness. I swear this game just has, like, random unnecessary framiness. There we go. And probably goblins chasing me now. Oh, wait, did he go down? Okay, I think he went down. 
Oh. Oh. There are goblins chasing me. Okay, level 40, so not that amazing. We're gonna have to take care of these goblins first. Oh, I hate these freaking trees and crap. I can't run. I'm getting bad frames. Why does everything hate me today? Okay, where's the goblins? Come on, goblin buddies. I see one, two, three. I've learned not to take goblin groups lightly. Just burn them and run. Burn them and run. Okay, is any more chasing me right now? Because I gotta go throw this thing down. There it is. Okay. Let's try to do this real quick. Right there. Oh, no, no, don't hurt my deer. And throw apples in there. Okay, you feast away. Ooh, and we're gonna try not to get knocked out. Come on. Come on, stupid. Oh, we got him. All right, now screw everybody else. Let's get home. Come on, stag. Just don't get attacked because like, he's not docile. And I don't really know all the whistles yet. Uh, I don't really know any of the whistles. I don't have any of them memorized. How do I just didn't make them the same as Ark? Come on. I mean, the rest of this game is pretty much an Ark copy, let's be honest. All right, guys. I have got a saddle. Let's go ahead and equip this sucker. Let's see. Is this it right here? Grut stag. Awesome. Now, he doesn't seem to have gotten any bonus levels, which is really strange to me. I don't know why that would be. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, let's see if we can harvest anything. Finally, we have something we can ride. All right, even if it's just for the moment. This. Okay, berries. That's nice. Okay, a little bit of flowers, a little bit of straw. What about for trees? We need, it'd be nice to get like a wood gatherer. He gathers a little bit of. Oh, yeah, he gathers wood just fine. He gathers wood and twine. It's perfect. Okay. So we're definitely going to want to level this guy up and wait. I'm thinking. hopefully is working now ah getting my mic on that's ridiculous all right um so let's go ahead what i want to do now is i realize after taming up that boar that there is no way in hell we're going to be able to do a couple more tames and be able to get it up to get the bargash saddle which i was hoping to do today um because it's just taking too long with taming stuff and whatnot so i think what we're going to do um it's been a little it's getting a little crowded in the house so i think i want to build a little bit of a of a gate or something a little pen here to keep my guys outside um, so I got my wood working up to the next level. So now we should be able to make, let's see. We've got simple spike walls. We've got simple barriers, I think we're going to use. Simple barrier door and door frame. Um, so I assume that stuff takes, let's see, twine, wood, and fur, of course. And we've got, I've been gathering a bunch of that. We should have plenty. Uh, let's see, we already got the fur in our inventory. Let's grab a bunch of twine. And I think we have more wood on the boar as well. I did gather up some with him. Come on. So I don't know exactly how many we're going to need. I'm going to assume that you don't need to put them on a some kind of foundation or something. Let's just do barrier. Uh, so obviously we're going to want a door frame and a door. First, let's check those out and see what they look like. Uh, okay. Let's see. Okay, it's a big door frame. Okay, I was worried I was going to have to do more than one, but I don't. Okay, so we got door frame and a door. And let's make some barriers. Let's craft uh, eight to start. Um, they much bigger than I thought, so I thought we were gonna need way more stuff, but apparently they're nice and big, so it might not be a problem. Okay, let's go ahead and load these suckers up, and then we'll go ahead and place it. So I guess I better drop some of this wood so we can actually walk around. How's that? Okay, we can move now. Ugh. Slowly, but we can move. 
So this is the barrier. Barrier six, eight will be the uh, gate. Come on, we got this. Okay, so we'll throw this sucker right here on the edge of our house. Perfect. I think we're just going to go straight across over here for now. Uh, actually, I'm already kind of doubting that. I think I should go out one more first. Uh, no, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, why did why did I only make one barrier? Didn't I just tell it to make like eight? What the heck? Ba simple barrier. Where'd they all go? Did I just make eight barrier doors? I just made eight barrier doors because I'm super smart. So let's go ahead and grab some of that wood back. All right, take two. Perfect, I think that's fine. I mean, can people like sneak around? Yeah, but <laughs> it's, it should be all right. Let's go ahead and get our guys. It's so dark. How do you gamma up? Oh, you know, what? we don't need to gamma up. We got a freaking light fairy. Come on, light fairy, it's starting to get dark. Give us your light. Uh, and let's go ahead and ride, let's take the boar out first. Uh, which I need to make sure he's on passive, because currently I don't think he is. Look, now, now they got all this room to run and play, they don't have to stay inside the house. Okay, so we're just gonna park him just kinda over here, it doesn't really matter. Anywhere's fine, wanna keep him fairly close to the trough. Okay, didn't mean to open the window, but that's cool. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and go ahead and get all these guys out here. Um, and then, oh, you can totally move, dude, you can do it! And we might have to put another trough out there as well. Um, but anyways, guys, this has been actually quite a bit of recording that we've been doing. I'm sure it's going to come out to be like a 10-minute video, though. <laughs> uh, a lot of stuff is off-camera, a lot of gathering and stuff. Um, but for today, guys, I do think that is going to be it. If you guys did enjoy the video or if you learned something, do me a favor and hit that thumbs up button. And, of course, feel free to subscribe and share and ring that notification bell if you have not done so already. You can also hit me up on all your social medias, your Twitter, your Instagram, your Facebook, your Google+, and even your Snapchat. Um, and I also have this link to a Streamlabs tip jar in the description below. And also follow me on Twitch. I've been doing more Twitch stuff recently. But anyway, guys, for today, I do appreciate you guys coming to hang out with me. And until next time, I will see you later.